Western Australia's Labor Party will meet to decide who will be the state's next Premier after leader Mark McGowan's shock resignation yesterday. WA Deputy Premier Roger Cook has put himself forward as a contender for the top job, stressing a need for continuity for the state. Health Minister Amber Jade Sanderson and Transport Minister Rita Safiotti are also being considered as two other lead candidates. Premier Mark McGowan will stand down by the end of the week after announcing in a last-minute press conference yesterday his intention to retire, although he'd been thinking about it for some time. But the truth is I'm tired, extremely tired. In fact, I'm exhausted. The role of political leadership doesn't stop. It's relentless. It comes with huge responsibility that is all-consuming each and every day. And, and combined with the COVID years, it's taken it out of me. Prime Minister Anthony Albanese faces a potential new push to unwind Australia's GST arrangements and create a more cohesive approach to China in the wake of the popular Premier's resignation. Tasmania is pushing the Commonwealth to revisit GST commitments. After Mr McGowan's negotiations with the federal government helped deliver major reforms in 2018, there's also a push push from New South Wales as well. Don Perrette had been after this <laughs> for a while. The Prime Minister has led tributes to the outgoing leader who's been in state politics for almost 30 years. I want to pay tribute to Mark McGowan, my friend, a confidant, but also an extraordinarily successful Premier of Western Australia. Without WA being so strong, uh, the recession that occurred uh, would have been deeper and longer.